greats and greats certainly who have been MVP candidates. We send it over to uh, two of DC's finest. Their own <laughs> David Aldridge is joined by John Wall. DA. DA. Well, I'm, I'm one of DC's decent. Yes, I'm one of DC's <laughs> finest. Uh, John, man, y'all are it's it's rolling right now. Uh, what would you say is what's been the biggest factor in this turnaround? I think everybody just coming and having confidence. Yeah. We're playing, we have a lot of confidence on both ends of the floor. And uh, coach solidified everything. We move the ball offensively. You know, we play team defense. Yeah. We're a tough team to, uh, to compete against. And when we get stops, we get out in transition. Mm -hmm. And um, guys are shooting the, the pitch out of the ball right now. <laughs> Otto Porter is knocking down shots for us. And we tell them to stay hot. Yeah. That is the, that's the one question I have. And I wonder what you think. Otto's leading the league in three-point shooting, I believe. Uh, Mark Keith Morris is shooting better than 40% on threes. Do you, is, is that sustainable over 82 games? Uh, I just wonder because that's really been, the, to me, a big difference. We know Brad can shoot it. Yeah, I think, you know what I mean, one thing with us, though, we're not making shots. We just still want to take open shots yeah. and um, play the right way. But uh, even when we're not making shots, we, I think the way we defend and the way we're taking care of the ball now, we're giving ourselves a chance to still win games. Yeah. When you're not making shots, you got to be able to get six or seven stops in a row. And a lot of close games that we've been in, we got six or seven stops in a row. And we might not have made the shot another end, but we're making those guys waste time on the shot clock. Yeah. So they might not shoot the ball great every night. Me and Brad might not be hot for a long stretch, but as long as you're doing the little things to play the right way, you give yourselves a chance to win. Plus, you guys have been great at home. You already, I think, exceeded your win total from all last year at home. Is that that home court advantage, is that is that something that y'all really feel tangibly is, is impacting games? Yeah, it's, it, we've seen it on the road when we had teams down 13 with three minutes to go, four minutes to go, and they crowd get into it, they get back into the game. Yeah. And uh, we've been in certain situations where we've been down in third and fourth quarter, and our crowd has been amazing for us. And, uh, we got 24 wins at home. That's almost more wins than I had my rookie year. So uh, if you're doing something right, uh, we can't do it without our amazing fans, and we hope they keep coming out and supporting us. Yeah. Uh, as you guys get, I mean, we're past the halfway point. It's almost a, the third of the season is left. But you have two big road trips, I think, in March out west, and you guys have been better on the road. What it needs to happen for you to kind of sustain that and be a team that can win games on the road against good teams? Uh, play the same way we play at home. Take care of the ball for one play team defense, uh, try to keep their crowd out of it. Mm -hmm. You know, we know the month of March we have a lot of road games. You know, we played a lot of home games already, but uh, that's going to be the key. If you want to be a playoff team and learn how to win, you got to know how to win on the road. So yeah. we have a great test coming right out of the All-Star break, so we got to keep our heads on the swivel. Uh, I assume Brad's going to be a little motivated since he's not here to uh, <laughs> the rest of the season. Yeah. Um, how important, I mean, you two have been two, been together for a while now, and it seems like the chemistry is at its all-time high. Um, it's great. I think both of us just being healthy. Um, I'm able to knock down shots for him when he's penetrating and kicking to me. And in the past, teams would just help off because I couldn't shoot the ball from there. And I think one thing he's doing a great job of is penetrating, getting yeah. to the free throw line a lot and attacking. And guys just can't settle for him shooting jump shots no yeah. more. Yeah. John, fourth All-Star appearance, man. Enjoy the weekend. As always, I'm sure you're going to have some, some things for us on Sunday that will be fun. Yeah, appreciate it. Thank you. All right, you. John. Thanks very much. Back to you all.